Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Tuba Player Negative AE, and I'm just kind of like looking through uh, truth bullets right now because we have a ton of them. Uh, and I did a little bit off screen. I was I was just reading all the stuff that we found, uh, and I was kind of wondering, hey, like there's food code. We probably could talk to him. But I'm thinking, right? And hear me out. I think it's that guy, Nagito. What the hell? Didn't I tell you to leave me alone? It's not happening. Didn't you hear Monokuma's announcement? Of course I did. Apparently Biaki is the only one who got killed. <laughs> so what? What did you say? Do you think I'm the killer? Think whatever you want. I'm used to being mistrusted. No, that's not why I'm... Whatever, just tell me what you were doing uh, why, uh, while everyone else was in the car. Uh, checking my alibi, eh? Well, I don't have one. I was just chilling in my cottage all by myself during that time. The whole time? Because Chikaki said she saw you in front of the old building. Shut up! Tch, nosy bitch. Jeez. It's true, I went for a little walk. Uh, and then just by chance I ended up passing by the old building. Were you really going for a walk? Don't tell me you were actually trying to join Don't the Don't fuck with me! Why the hell would I do that? It's a coincidence. A coincidence! Alright, I got you. <laughs> Dumbass. Dude, I know that you're just a nice guy at heart. This guy's the killer. And I'm thinking that because... <clears throat> if you look at... Let me, just, let me just show you guys, real quick. If you look at... Uh, okay, so first of all, let's look at what's her name. Can we see the, the pictures? You can't see the pictures again. Whatever. But if you look at um, Ibuki's account... Uh, listen to all the people. There's Mahihiru, there's Kazuichi, I highly I can't see anything. Ibuki, it's pitch black, my future is uh, pitch black. Everyone calm down, we gotta stay so That's uh, Mahihiru. Kiyoko, uh, uh, don't step on my feet. Byakuya, what the hell? What's going on here? This, this is... And then, ow. Okay, so he says ow at the end. Uh, turn the damn lights on, I can't eat like this, you know. Tataru. Why are you guys back at which was in perhaps uh, Kazuichi? Hold on a sec, I'll go on the wall and do something about it. Okay. So he says ow, but he doesn't say anything else? I don't know. He's and he was standing by the AC and the ACs were both set to the same time. I just feel like uh okay, where's his room first of all? Okay, there's Demon Guy's room, there's Tedward's room, this is team manager's room, this is Nagito's cottage. This is Biakio's cottage. It's locked. Hey. I guess we need to ask him for help. Nagito, also Nagito took a deep. Hey! Hey, Monokuma. Did you call me? <laughs> Nagito, uh, when did you train Mani, uh, Monokuma? Hey. Hey, Monokuma, I was wondering if you could do us a favor. There's something you want to investigate. What's this? Hey, who are you talking to? That's just my after image. <laughs> When I get serious, my after image is finished. I can even play soccer by myself as long as I have this cloning technique. I thought it'd be boring to play alone. I don't have time for this. Let's hurry up and open Jack's cottage already. Well, this is for the class trial. It's something we really need hmm? for the class trial. This is well, I guess if it's for the class trial, there's no way I can refuse. No, then there's only one spell that can open these doors. Ba -ba -ba Wait, why does it open with a magic Jeez. spell? Probably powered by electricity. At any rate, the performance was a waste of time. Guess we should go inside. You're right. Then. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, so what is this? The first thing that caught my eye. There's an envelope on this table. To Byakia Tagami. Oh, so someone was like, hey, I'm gonna kill you. You better. That's freak weird. Out. There's no sender. This looks pretty Hajime. suspicious. Suspicious. Hajime, you should check what's inside. Yeah, you're right. Let's see. And that's why he threw the party. The first kill will ha happen tonight. Someone will definitely kill someone. Be careful. The first kill will happen tonight. Someone will definitely kill someone. That's why he was so careful. This is, this is a crime warning. It's, uh, no. If it says 
Be careful, it's probably a threatening one. Regardless, who would send something like this? Maybe. Hey. This is why Byakia suddenly decided to throw a party? Huh? The first kill will happen tonight. Because someone made his threat to Byakia. Okay. Okay. Let's pause right here. We're not gonna like end the episode or anything. But let's think. Nagito was the one who he, he he was the one who cl cleaned up the the house, right? So he could have set the timers to 11:30. Uh, I didn't check the the timers at the beginning because it was just like you should go to the dining room hall, and I did. Uh, however, the time he could have set the timers while he was cleaning, and um, I don't know. And he was standing by the AC when the AC made that noise, and then the thing went out. And then someone reset it, so he could have. You know what he could have done? Is he overpowered the system, so that it blew out everything, like all the lights and stuff blew out. So that's when Monokuma came and reset the breaker. I just think he's awfully suspicious right now, and he's awfully carefree. Ah, uh, the sin uh, monitor to each other. He thought that if he did that, nobody would be able to kill anyone. So he believed this crazy nice. letter? He couldn't ignore the possibility of this happening, even if it was the worst case yeah. scenario. Remember what Byakia kept saying? He wouldn't let anyone become a victim. He couldn't overlook this slim possibility just to keep his promise. Then why did he keep it a secret? If he had just told us, nope. he probably couldn't. He probably thought that was also a worst case scenario. What do you mean? If everyone knew what was in the letter, whether it's a lie or not, everyone would have likely begun to doubt each other, and at that point there'd be no turning back. So Byakia tried to do something about this all by himself without telling him. Yep. A strong sense of responsibility and is the only explanation I can think of. Not. Anyway, whoever sent Byakia this letter also killed him, is what you're saying. Sorry. No. This could be a prank, and it might have uh, had nothing to do with Byakia's death at all. See, this is, I re, I don't know, he doesn't, he doesn't want to believe one of us could be a killer, but still, we've come all this way and it's the only thing I can think of. The person who uh, wrote this letter murdered Byakia, and if that's the case, that person completely predicted how Byakia would react once he received it, right? They planned to manipulate Byakia and killed him right before our eyes in that old book. So someone's lying. We also have to take that into account. Is someone killed him. So someone's lying. Because someone wants to cover their tail. Murder threat has been added to your truth set, uh, hey. bullets. I demand there's probably not much time left until the class trial starts. Probably. Uh, <laughs> uh, which reminds me. Have you asked Mahiru for a favor earlier, right? Yeah, I wanted to find out where everybody was standing right before the blackout. She probably finished by now. Uh, you're coming with me, right? Uh, sorry. Sorry, that's all you. Huh? I need some time alone. Uh, like, I'd like some time to collect my thoughts. I see, I understand. Hey. Also, if you're going back to the old building, you should hear what Mikan has to say as well. I think the result of her autopsy should be ready by Bye now. Bye I'll see you later. That's weird. He's pretty pale. I wonder if he's okay. I really think it's him. I really think it's him. Um, he had he had all the thing to set everything up. He couldn't cover all of the floor. Um, he definitely could have. I'm thinking that like he could have like taken carpet. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just I'm just being I'm just laying out the facts, right? Like it's definitely he had all the time in the world to set that up. I'm guessing there's nothing else here. Wait. Wait, turn around. Go back in. At the last second, I saw a Monokuma doll. Excuse me, Monokuma, I see you way the F up there. No. There's 30 coins. I imagine I'm not going to be able to ever enter this room again, so I'm glad that I found it. So that's that. Where did we talk to a girl that was eating a ton? 
Oh yeah, Monami, let's talk to you, dude. Or girl. You know, stuff, right? <laughs> this is just too cool. Oh yeah, might as well ask her about the old building's windows. Hey, do you have a sec? I wanted to ask you something. I don't want to help you guys mistrust your friends. What the hell? It's not like we're doing this because we want to. That's not the time to fight about stuff like that. More importantly, do you know why the old building's windows are covered by iron plates? Huh? Iron plates? I covered them up in case, uh, so nobody makes the mistake of going inside. It's dangerous because of the re renovation. I see, the renovation, so that's why you covered them. Because it's dangerous to go inside. Danger isn't supposed to exist on this island. This isn't how it's supposed to be. Why did it get like this? It's too cruel. Uh, just because it's cool doesn't mean you can keep crying like that. Crying won't solve anything. Why aren't you saying this to her? We have to do this no matter what, damn it. Okay. So I guess that literally got me nowhere. <laughs> what the? What the hell was that loud voice just now? from inside the office? I'm guessing it was the bathroom? Yeah, it's definitely not in the office. It's gotta be. <laughs> what the hell is that loud voice just now? You're in the toilet? I don't really need to go right now, but there's really, there's really no need for me to go inside. Dude, go inside! This is the... So stupid. What are you what are you doing, dude? Why are you laughing? Huh? Feels so lighthearted right now. <laughs> I, Nekomaru, need I have been reborn. I have no intention of losing anymore. Losing to who? Oh. I won't lose to anyone. Not even my past self. Sounds cool and all, but what are you talking about? Sure. What? I don't know who is behind it, but someone tried to make a shitty bastard out of me. Some scoundrel was occupying the bathroom before the party was about to start. I didn't mention you did say something like that before the party started. Jeez. If you think I'd be angered by something like that, you've underestimated my nerve and my patience. Um, uh, presence of mind, this goal is true. In other words, a leader must never falter in any situation, but always have the presence of one's mind. He says that, but I'm pretty sure he was shaken up by the whole ordeal. Well, I better not get- I best not go into it. Anyway, you're saying the bathroom door was shut before the party started? to after the blackout. So what I mean is... And the bathroom was finally unoccupied after Byaki's body was found. That's about how long it lasted. But I should remember it just in case. Nekomaru's account has been added to the truth bullet section of your handbook. I think there's a hole in the toilet. I'm thinking that there's a hole in the toilet. Okay, before I go in there, let's see if it'll let me go in now that he said that about the toilet. Okay, no. They're just gonna tell me to go F myself and I'll go back in here. Okay. Where did what's her name go? Where did where did Okay, I'm talking to Mikan because she's my girl. Uh if you'd like, I can tell you a little bit about what I want to say. Did you find out anything? Well, I tried within reason to perform an autopsy on Byakuya's body, and I discovered that there were several puncture wounds around Byakuya's chest and abdominal region. Deep wounds. Deep enough to reach his lungs and internal organs. It can be assumed that it was a very sharp, thin object around 5 millimeters in diameter which used to stab him over and over and over again, which is why I believe... Hey, are you okay? I'm so sorry, talking about it made me sad. No need to push yourself. I must have got the gist of what you wanted to say. I'm sorry. Around five and one. Isn't that pretty thin? This uh, ice pick or an owl. And it's in the truth section of your handbook. So the knife couldn't have been used to kill Byakuya. The knife was put there. I really think it's Nagito, but why would he tell me to go do all this stuff? Maybe it would seem less suspicious. Where the hell did you wander off to? I wasn't wandering, I was investigating as much as I could. I see. We weren't slacking off then, I guess. It's fine. Did you find anything? Yeah, sorta. 
You don't sound too sure. Hey. Well, just take a look at this. Um. As you told me, uh, using the two photos I took before the blackout, I tried to pinpoint just where everyone was standing. When I did, this diagram was the result. Okay, so this is everyone's standing position before the blackout. Everyone is pretty much in the dining hall. Okay. All windows are covered. There's a camera. Uh, Fuhiko's position is he's outside. He was outside, and he was in his room, and he's definitely not the killer. Chikaki was outside, and that's Chikaki's account of things. So she was just outside. I, I have no thing. No one was in the bathroom. Uh, Peko is, wasn't in the thing. We know that because... What's his name? Went in there. So Nagito is closest to that, but Byakuya is on the other side of the room. It's pretty accurate. Just the starting at far distance from that table. It's impossible. There's no way he'd be able to move that far during the blackout. What's this line extending uh, from the table where Byakuya was killed? Oh, uh, it's the desk lamp. I drew the power cord for it just in case. Power cord for the desk lamp. If that cord is extending from the table where Byakuya was killed, that means... Hey! Did you find something? Yeah, it's not clear to me yet, hmm. but... I you're right, I didn't really understand it, but what does that mean? I have a feeling it's either a potential clue or a waste of labor. It wasn't a waste huh? at all. Hmm? Not clear to me yet, but there's no mistake that a clue is hidden here. An extremely important clue. Alright, so this is where the class trial is going to begin, I believe. Um, I'm going to end the episode right here, and next episode we will go forth with uh, this class trial, and we're going to see if my suspicion is right, because I believe it's Nagito. I believe that it is him, and if it is not him, I'll be very surprised. In fact, well, okay. I didn't really talk to what's-her-name, the girl that was eating lots of food. But I don't really suspect her. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what happens. She's been awfully, awfully absent uh, during investigation time. Uh, anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. This has been Tuba Player Negative AE, and uh, we will finish this uh, investigation, I guess, in the next episode, possibly.